Okay now, suppose you have an chat application. If some of you users swipe away a message knowingly or unknowingly, it might be useful to display some brief message and tell the user that your message was deleted. And this is not only specific to only chat app, this can be any other app to show users some brief message that this task was happened. And in our app's material design, the job of showing brief message to a user is done by either a toast message or a snack bar. So first of all, we'll go for the snack bar. So, to show a snack bar in our Flutter application, we have again the simple application and elevator button in here and the click me in here in the, in the child of the elevator button and in the on press. For now it's empty. Let's open this up and now we are going to show a snack bar when the elevator button is pressed. So to show a snack bar for that we have the scaffold messenger. And from the scaffold messenger we are going to call the off method which accept the context and here it has the method of show snack bar and this show snack bar accepts a snack bar widget just like this and it has the content property which is required and this content property accepts the widget and we will pass our text widget in here and simply we will say hello i am snack bar and simply put the semicolon in here and Put the commas in here and format your code just like that. Now control S to hurt reload and click this click me button and you can see we got the hello I am snack bar a simple snack bar from the scaffold messenger and the scaffold messenger has some other methods like to remove or hide the snack bar. So to use them we will copy this scaffold messenger of context and paste it in here and simply we will do dot remove the current snack bar and this will directly remove the current snack bar but for that we need to give some delay to let this snack bar appears and and after some seconds we will remove the current snack bar so for that we have to make this asynchronous and here we have the future delay just like that which accept the duration and in the duration we will pass the seconds of two like after two seconds the and also not forget to put the await in front of it as this is the feature. Now control S to hurt reload and click this and after 2 seconds this will appear directly just like that. And if we reduce the seconds to 1, control S to hurt reload and click this, you can see this appears and after 1 second it directly disappears just because of this remove current snack bar. And we have the hide current snack bar method which also removes the current snack bar but with a little bit animation like control s to hurt reload and click this after one second it goes just like that so that's how these methods works and that's how we can show snack bar in our flutter application and with this we have also a toast message if you want to show it instead of the snack bar so for that you have to add a dependency in your pubspec.yml file so simply add this flutter toast dependency in your pubspec.yml file after this pubgit and to get the dependencies. After this done, go to your main.dart and comment this out. And to access the flutter toast, we have the flutter toast and from this simply access the show toast which has the property of message and is required. Simply say hello I am toast message and it has some properties like let's say the gravity toast gravity dot bottom like we want to display it on the bottom and it has the font size let's say 16 it has the background color let's say color start red and it has the toast length let's say toast dot length short and also it has the property of text color color start white like the color of the text will be white in the red background color. Now control S to hurt reload and simply click this click me. You can see we got a toast message. Hello, I am toast. And you can also change the background color to let's say yellow accent. Control S to hurt reload and click this click me. And we got this toast message with the yellow accent color and put it green accent. Control S to hurt reload and we also got this. And if we set the green and simply click this so you can see this is more clear than the before accents colors of yellow and the green and we can also change the text color from here so that's how you can deal with the snack bar and also the toast in your flutter application and for this toast you have to add the dependency in your pubspec.yml file that is the dependency of flutter toast and you will get to know more about these in the future videos